our hearts love bind us to your will we praise you almighty god and king as i talk i remember cardinal bernardin cardinal bernardin archbishop of chicago and this cardinal bernardin very simple priest he never went to rome to study so he couldn't even say, I've studied in Rome. Who? But he was made an Archbishop of Chicago. And he tried it in many ways because the church is like a family. And in a family there are squabbles. In the family one person thinks one way and another person thinks another way. In a family, you know, even though you have the same parents, we are so different, aren't we? We are so different from our brothers and sisters. It's the same with the church. I'm not surprised that there are squabbles because we are humans. But you need people of leadership and of guts. People to make a radical decision for Jesus to say, hey, we need to find a way around these squabbles. We can't go squabbling. And this Cardinal Bernardin tried what he called common ground when he said, people on the right and people on the left, can we at least come and talk about what's common about us? And of course, he was criticized for that. He was criticized from both right and both left. And he used to say an image. Yes, I'm a bridge builder. We're well, terrific to be a bridge builder. The only problem with being a bridge builder, you know what it is? That both sides walk over you. And you have to be, be able to sort of accept that and to be able to endure it. And he was diagnosed with cancer. Where are my dreams now? Where are my hopes? And he went for his treatment, and it went well, but then the cancer came back, and they told him, we can't do much for you. You know what he did, this man? Yes, I'm a patient with cancer. I'm dying of cancer. So he used to go to the hospitals and visit other cancer patients. And he will pray with cancer patients and he will talk to them because you and I are in the same boat. That you and I are undergoing the same bitter experience. But I'm here because I want to bring this Jesus with me so that even in the end that we have to go, even at that moment, Jesus is there and he will turn what seems into tragedy into a triumph. My friends, this is what means to follow Jesus Christ. This is what means to make a radical decision for Jesus. Conquer our hearts, Lord. Mind.